Yo, what up guys, so welcome back to some more Fallout 4. Uh, so we're gonna be back from where we left off. Uh, if you can remember, we've completed the quest with the railroad. But before I start this episode, I just wanna say sorry guys. I really want to apologize. I was away for the whole weekend. And uh, yeah, there was some uh, work related stuff. So yeah, it's... I only came back on Sunday evening. I was super tired. I haven't recovered even um, How do you call it even on Monday? I couldn't recover as well yesterday Tuesday Was the same story. I was yesterday. I was actually trying to record yesterday on Tuesday But for some reason nothing wanted to work like my audio was completely out of sync So I, I didn't know how to fix it, but I think now finally I've done it. So I just want to say sorry guys I I could have started uploading from yesterday, but I'm just going to continue from today, so I hope you guys understand. Well, I'm, I'm going to do my best to uh, bring all these episodes very quickly. But if you can remember, we completed uh, the Tradecraft quest. Uh, with, uh, I mean, in the company of Deacon. And we brought by the device to Doc Carrington, which gave us a quest uh, regarding, uh, how do you call it? The old man Stockton. So I don't think I'm gonna I'm gonna sleep right there. I'm just gonna continue straight with the quest because the quest has to be completed during the night time. So I think it will be much more smarter to complete it to continue with with it right now. So as usual, so if you guys enjoyed this video, uh, just leave a like button definitely. If you want to see more of this type of content, consider subscribing to this gaming channel as well. And without being said, guys, let's just let's get to it. All right, so we're now in the underground tunnel. I'm just gonna speed everything. I'm gonna go as fast as I can through this tunnel. I mean, there's even nothing to grab in here, so yeah, I won't. Oh, wait, what's this? No, nothing. So yeah, there's nothing much to grab, or nothing valuable. So I'm not gonna waste too much time in here. I don't have the perk required. So let me just open this gate. And normally there should be a terminal right here, which I need to use to open the following door. Alright, and as usual, let me just hit a save. There we go. Alright, so here I'm gonna have to play a bit stealthy. So let me check, there's nothing here. Let me just open the gate. As usual, hit a save. Yeah, so... Uh, Fallout... Uh, I mean, there is new item in the creation, in the creation club, so... It means that the Fallout 4 scripted extender had needed to be updated and uh, yeah, what else? Yeah, some of the mods as well, so I don't know why my flashlight got back to green, but I'm assuming that's the main reason why. Come on, hit that headshot. There you go. I'm not hiding for anyone. There we are, Pigman Gallery. Oh boy. So Pigman Gallery is... Uh, is I'm gonna visit it again for, uh, for a mission. For Hancock, ooh, flip, in good neighbor, come on, hit it, there you go, jackpot, there you go, oh, I'm doing well so far, oh, flip, let me quick, uh, oh, oh, come on, there's so much happening, guys, this thing's gonna blow, Yeah, I don't want to be near it. Alright, so I know there was a, a legendary. Oh boy. Oh boy, look at that. My arm completely gone. Oh, yeah, just to recover a legendary item. There, there you go. Uh, so, lever action rifle, dead eye. That's actually a pretty awesome one. But as usual, you know me, I'm just going to exchange it to get a legendary microchip and uh, yeah, definitely add another legendary mod to one of my weapons already. Damn it. Alright, I'll grab all of this. Oh boy, I'll grab this as well. Yeah, so I love scrapping and um, scrapping. <laughs> I love collecting uh, all this stuff. I know there's a power armor on that side, but I'm not gonna worry too much about it right now. 
here I just need to, to I just want to focus on the mission it's where do I have to go again oh and it's it's on the side so maybe I should equip uh, the other one Okay, I can take that arm off. Alright, so, so far so good. Oh wait, first I need to, re to retrieve a dead drop. Yeah. Yeah, I need to get that dead drop, absolutely. Yeah, so I don't know um I don't know how the mods are gonna be supported, I mean for this game. I mean in the in the weeks or months to come, but it feels like every, most people have actually switched to Fallout 76. I actually own some a Fallout 76, but uh I mean, I did most of the main quests. I haven't completed the main quests entirely, but hey, I've done the most. But uh, definitely, what I'm looking forward to is um, how do you call it? Uh, the mods, the mod support. Definitely, I'm looking forward for that for Fallout 76. But they also added the battle, the battle royale, which I actually tried, and I, I'm not a battle royale person, but I actually enjoyed it. For some reason, I really enjoyed it. Uh, I've only made one recording, unfortunately, because I told you again I was away. So after that, I could not do anything at all. So unfortunately, the free trial is done, but definitely uh, more amazing content arriving, and I think I would want to cover it definitely. But hey, let's focus here. Fallout 4. You there, caravan or raider? Just me. Here on my own, freelance, huh? Monument here. All right. Joke. Come on in, but no gunfire. Market's open. You can do as much trading as you like. All right. Thank you, Kessler. <laughs> Market's the white building with all the fancy columns. Always someone so in here, we need to talk to, to the old guy. Welcome, my friend. Might I ask, do you have a Geiger counter? Mine is in the shop. In the shop. <laughs> I was expecting someone a bit more uh, armed. You're with our mutual friends, yes? So all the conversation, I'm going to speak covertly for all of them. Let's say I am. Of course. You've just joined, haven't you? All you need to know is this is the first stop for all our new packages. So maintaining proper security here and preventing any unnecessary delays is crucial. A trader always has to move his merchandise efficiently. Exactly. My current package has been in my possession far too long. I'm supposed to deliver the package to some place nearby, but raiders have complicated matters. So, if you could... Facilitate delivery. Hm. I can do that. It's scheduled to be a nighttime delivery, so if you could clear out the undesirables before dawn, we can do this tonight. See you soon. Alright, so that's completed. We could stay here for a while. Now I need to get to uh, the rendezvous place. So I already know where it is. So if you just get out of Bunker Hill and then go on all the way to the right. So normally there should be a passage, a, a passage, I don't know, a way that leads to, um, how do you call it? Uh, be, be a bad TFO, yeah, the, that police station or something. And from what I also know here, they usually a legendary, I mean, not a legendary, but a, a death claw, a very high level death claw. Come on, let's hit that jackpot. Got it. Some skill you have there. Normally, there should be a, a second raider. Ah, oh, come on. Alright, so I'm glad this enemy is a legendary then. Harpoon gun. I love it. 
I'll keep that bear. I'm almost at my limit there. I'm at carry limit. Maybe I should have just grabbed that power armor. Wait, what? <laughs> That's gore. But guy, yeah, yes, yeah, so I use a lot of vets. But there's there's actually a cool mod uh, that I saw on the Nexus. I can't remember. Uh, yeah, I think the name of the mod is Vaths or something like that. But I think I'm probably gonna try it because I think vets are a bit cheated. Uh, very overpowered and all. So maybe I might want to change it. But hey, we'll see about it. Alright, so I'm way over my carry weight. Do I have some grid rat stack? Yeah, definitely. Always come in handy. Oh, let me guess, it's raiders against uh, ferals. What the hell? There we go, level 42. Alright, so I'm quickly gonna level up as well. So I'm gonna take the perk uh, Scrapper. And the reason why I'm taking it because uh, there's a good mod on the Nexus that allows you to scrap all the junk. Alright, so now I'm at the rendezvous. All I need to do is to wait for old man Stockton. Uh, stock. Okay, I'm here. Alright, I really don't know what they're waiting for. Oh, there he is. Hey. Everything looks clear. This is H222. H2, here's the person I talked to you about. Uh, H2, where you at? Nice to meet you, H2. Another person actually happy to meet me. This'll take some getting used to. Remember what I told you, H2. I'll fire up the signal. Alright, so if you can see on the other side, with all the lights and all, it's coming from um, the very first mission in the Automatron DLC. So I'm also going to cover the DLC, uh, but not right now. And Time for me to go. Keep H2 safe. Someone will be here shortly. Hey, H2. From what I've been told, it's probably safer if I don't say anything. I don't want to put you in any more danger. Oh, there's a guy I was waiting for. Oh, come on, high rides. Where are you going? Come back here. Easy there. Don't shoot. Whisper. Right? I heard about it. Oh, sweet. Do you have a Geiger counter? Right you are. Mine is in the shop. All good? Now, let's take a look at our friend. Hey, you. You okay? A little rattled, but I've never been better. The other man, he said I shouldn't talk too much. He told you right, H2. You'll need a real name and a new face, but we'll get to that. Oh, listen. There's more than raiders behind me. I'm afraid we need a little more help. More raiders? Not a problem. You headquarter heavies mean business. We need to get to Ticonderoga's safe house, my home. A lot of sense fresh off the boat crashed there until we smuggled them out of the Commonwealth. Do you do anything else there? Most of what we do is look after the new guys. They usually got a million questions, so I try and answer as best I can. We got some of our own questions, too about the Institute and whatnot. Agents sometimes drop by to lay low if the bad guys are on their tail. Never a dull moment. I'll lead the way. All right. Come on, high rise. Let's be, let's be on the way. Um, again, as usual, let me quickly hit an auto, an auto save right there. 
Hey, you know, I love being careful, you know. Here, normally, there should be some ferals and raiders and all of that. What? That critical shot. Whoa, what the fuck? <laughs> oh boy, guys. I got flipping scared right there. I think it's because of my headphones. It felt like there was actually someone close to me asking me where was that. <laughs> oh boy. Come on, high rise. It's not this scared here. Oh boy! Wait, that's my crazy here, right? Damn, this guy's playing with me right there. <laughs> Come on, let's hit that headshot. Alright, simple. Charlestown a safer place, one asshole at a time. Alright guys, let's not waste time in here. Whoa. There you go, that's how you take care of business. Uh, let me guess, maybe there's something I can eat right there. Alright, so I think I should be good now. Where the hell is he going? That's not the way, guys. Yeah, that's right. Alright, so it's midnight in game time. Alright, come on. High rides. Yeah, so it takes quite a lot of time just to get to, you know, just to, to follow this uh, this path and all. Hey, high rise. And we're here. All in a night's work for you agent types. Huh. Just part of the service. I think I'm gonna like you even more than uh -huh. if you ever need grub, bullets, or just a power nap. Take the elevator up to Tycon. My house is yours. But right now, I need to take care of H2. Later. Alright, so I'm also gonna go up there because uh there's a magazine. Uh that I need to grab in all.
Alright, so I'm not gonna worry too much about this fat man. So I'm gonna grab all these caps. Oh, I could actually slip in here even. I'll grab this, come on, can I? Thank you. Uh, a suit, I don't think I'll need a suit. You're from HQ, right? Of course, yeah. of course. Commonwealth ain't safe at night. Actually, let me do this. Let me first scrap uh some of these legendaries that I don't need at all. That way I can get all these microchips. Uh, so the magazine is in here. Yep. Guns and bullets. So it increases uh, the damage ballistics by, I mean, the critical. Commonwealth ain't safe at night. By five, by five percent. So very simple. I'm gonna take a nap here in the safe house, and then uh, I'll cut all the way to the railroad HQ. All right. So we are back inside the the HQ right there. Uh, I don't want to speak to Deacon. Carrington. The H-222 situation appears to have been resolved satisfactorily, there's but there's yet more to be done. Since the fall of the switchboard, we've ascertained the fate of all of two safe houses. I want you to check on Augusta. The blimp is called the Pridwin, and it's... The safe houses are in trouble too? I thought only the switchboard was attacked. Ah, the Institute didn't content itself with just destroying our headquarters. No. They launched simultaneous strikes on all we hold dear. Herkimer and Allen safe houses are both confirmed kills. Many fear Augusta will be added to that list. How bad did the Institute hurt us, Doc? Frankly, we're lucky there's a railroad left at all. I don't remember a time our numbers have been so few. But the mission carries on. Tell me about Augusta. Details away to the dead drop. Have a care. Odds are very good you're walking into something nasty. Alright, but still sends me right there. Tinker Tom's cooking up something. I hope it goes better than last time. Alright guys, so I'm gonna end it right here for this part, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, in the next one, I think maybe it's time to resume the story just a bit with the Brotherhood of Steel, then I'll jump with the Minutemen as well. But uh, yeah, so that's the plan, so I'm gonna stop it right here with the Railroad for now, temporarily, and move on to the Brotherhood of Steel. So I'll see you guys in the next part, then. Cheers!